Cheyenne, you get to help us with egg checks yeah. today. Let's see, we're gonna look in here. Does Kate have any eggs? Let's see, Cheyenne, take a look. Oh, she's in the lay box, but no eggs. No okay, we she's keep ready going. to give us eggs. Yeah, she is huge. How about bacon? Gonna look inside. Oh, oh she's skinny. Bacon does look skinny, Cheyenne. Let's take a look. Are there eggs? You see any? Uh oh, I see some white things. Do right you? There. <gasps> there are eggs! You can't eat them. So Bacon here is one of the OGs on the channel, actually. Yes, We've had her a long time. She is Het Snow, which means she has two Hets, Albino and Exanthic, which when combined creates a snow hog nose. Well, we happened to pair her to a snow. We paired her with John Snow. Yeah, and a really buggy. Oh, that's right. This oh, is that's S right. Yep, I forgot. Yeah. Oh, you can't eat me, John. Sorry. Yeah, so. This is our experimental clutch. He has bug eyes. Yes, and he does. we have been told two different things. One, if you get bug eyes in your collection or in a baby, you're stuck with it. You can't breed it out of them. You just have to stop breeding that line. And I've also heard that you just have to outcross them with an unrelated snake and you can get rid of it. Yeah. So we are breeding him with bacon, Ooh, right, Cheyenne? I'm pretty sure 100% different. Yes, very, very, very unrelated. Far. Anyway. Yes, so with these eggs, we should get some albinos, exanthic snows, and normals, but we're really going to be looking at their eyes yeah. to see you which wanna, of those theories you know, is correct. That's what bug eyes looks like. That's what normal eyes looks like. So, yeah, you can obviously see a difference. Oh, yeah. And actually, I noticed John here is a conda as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so that means he is a yeti, is what conda snow is. And he's upside down. And well. he's upside down. <laughs> so we're going to, I guess, have an interesting clutch here. But first, we have to see how many eggs we have. Cheyenne, are you going to help? Here, we have to look at the eggs. We're going to open this up. Cheyenne's first egg experience, I yeah, think. I egg think so. setup. Maybe at home one time. Maybe, yeah. yeah. Well, oh, and by the way, she was so skinny. I'm oh. pretty sure we checked. She yes. had no eggs. She got all the eggs out successfully, yeah. so that is great. Now let's see how many chances we have at snows and to disprove or prove this bug eye hypothesis. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, there's Thank more under you. the Wow, Cheyenne, look at all those eggs. Can you take some moss off for me? No. She doesn't so care mom, at I don't all. want to do any of this. Oh, there you go. And there's no treats involved. Okay. okay. <laughs> well, let's take a closer look. And, oh my gosh, there's more underneath bacon. What an overachiever. Bacon good with her clutches, if I remember. Yeah, oh, this looks amazing. Oh, is that one, two, popped, three. or is that just uh, oh, Just oddly deflated. deflated. Okay. Yeah, and this one's top, though, so that's interesting, side by side. One, two, three, that... Mm, yeah, that be good. I think it's all right. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. A nice 12 even eggs. dozen. All right, let's set them up. Look at these beautiful eggs. Not a single slug either. Well, maybe one. All maybe right. this first one, so yeah. Incubate, no matter what. Absolutely. These are gorgeous. Nice big eggs. No wonder she looks so little now. Yeah. Can I fit them all in this hog nose egg container? Oh. Might have to squeeze a little bit, but I Might. think it'll be fine. Yeah. Uh. Put another one in that top corner. Okay, I'll turn this around. We can fit some right here. Oh yeah, you only get two left. Perfect. Yeah. There, beautiful. Now, what should the theme for this clutch be? Well, I think since we're looking at looking for bug eyes, getting rid of them. Oh yeah. Let's do a bunch of bugs. Oh, good idea. you guess what they all are. Some are better than others. <laughs> uh, so top right is ladybug. Yep. Top left is a butterfly. Yep. Then we got a stag beetle. Yeah, nice okay. job. Uh, dragonfly. Uh huh. Bumblebee. Yep. So this one doesn't fit the theme because that's a snail, right? Oh, I guess invertebrates is what I, or pests. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Yeah, okay, yes, yeah, snail. Snails are now bugs. Yes. <laughs> Generic beetle? It was supposed to be a grasshopper with his big legs, but we don't have two shades of green, so it didn't that makes work. Sense. Uh, fly, house yep. fly, ant. Mm hmm, fire ant. Uh, that is a praying mantis. Yeah, nice. Firefly? Actually, I, it was supposed to be a roach, but it looks more like a firefly, so we're going to go with firefly. Perfect. Firefly. And a little catatapillar. That's right! Bug clutch! And snail. And snail. <laughs> 
Not Joy and Aziraphale. This is now Bacon and John, the hog noses, laid on 5.30, due on July 24th. Ta-da! First clutch. Yeah. Well, of this video. Yeah. Okay, Cheyenne, now we put it into the incubator. Can we put her in the incubator too? Do you go in there too? It's nice and Whoa, warm. Oh, you would probably like it in there. It's a nice 81 degrees. Nope, you don't get incubated, no. sorry. You have to help us find more eggs. Let's check Leanna. Sure. What do you think, Cheyenne? We have a snake in a box. Ooh, we have a really big snake oh, in a box. Snake who's ready to give us eggies, but yes. doesn't have them yet. Not yet, so we put them back. Shine's like taking lessons, it's kind of cool. She is. Okay, do you want to check this one next? Asami, oh. She looks. She kind of looks big still. Big but, oh, oh, oh there's yeah, an there's egg. Right there. Yes, oh, Cheyenne, look. Oh, there's eggs in that one too. First things first, did she get all of them out? Yes. Uh, oh yeah, she got them all out. No lumps? Yes. No lumpies. Okay, perfect. And what then Asami, pair we paired with Soul over here, yeah. uh, who albino is, boy. yeah, albino conda, head exanthic. Soul, where are you? Oh, there you are, he's in shed. Oh, of that. course. Well, he's usually brighter than this, but he's deep in blue right yeah. now. But Soul is, again, an albino conda. So these babies, since she's not head albino or anything, none of them will be albinos, but yep. they'll all carry it since yep. he is, and about 50% of them should be exanthic. And then so many of those should be conda on top yeah, of that. Yeah, that's right, with that conda passing down. Ooh, let's see how many odds we have for a conda exanthic. Let's look. I meant to say how many chances we have, not how many odds we have. How many odds? We have one odd there. Yep. And it doesn't seem like oh, a whole lot. Two there's odds. a second odd. Is it just a couple eggs? Oh, no, oh, there they are. She hid oh. them. Whoa, yes, she did. Look at these nestled in. Okay, so we have one. Is that a slug? Oh, this is the teeniest, tiniest little slug I think I've ever seen. Well, it's actually round and it has a vein in it. We could try. Do we? Uh, you know what? It's not gonna incubate well. No, so it I won't. Let's not. I don't want to like grow a runt snake just for it to suffer. Yeah, so look we... at that little slug. Oh my gosh! What the heck? And this one too. Oh, she has a broken eggshell oh, in here. Weird. Okay, interesting clutch. But we, we have, have some good over eggs. There, four or five? I think so. Yeah, we have five good eggs. It looks like. All now, right. Cheyenne, you watched us set up the last clutch. That means you get to set up this clutch. You can do it. I believe in you. Uh, Well, she did her best. Good job, Cheyenne. I think it looks great. Think you might have to just make huh. new holes for the yeah. eggs to sit in. I might, I might have to redo that part, but, but you, you mixed know, it really other well. Yeah, she did a good job. She did. Cheyenne, look at your beautiful creation. Yeah. That's gorgeous. All right, you're a good girl. We'll yeah. set up these eggs. You're tolerant. <laughs> Oh, oh, she still wants to come and help you. We don't need your help she anymore, does, Cheyenne. Though. Oh, Mom okay. Really needs there you your go. Help, Cheyenne. Good job. Thanks for supervising. I'm <laughs> doing it wrong. Okay, our theme for this clutch, since Cheyenne is an old lady, is old lady stuff. So mm -hmm. we have, let's see if Ed can guess Man, them. That one's a walker. Yep. Facebook? Oh no, a cane. Yep, that's okay. a cane, nice. So there's like a little thing that makes it look like the Facebook logo. Oh yeah, but no, yeah, it's so a cane. It's totally a cane. Yep. A bowl? It's supposed to be Depends underwear. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it yeah. didn't really work. Cheyenne, Cheyenne does. What are you eating? Need Depends. Yeah, she does. Yeah. You can't hold it in anymore, huh? Nope. Yeah. Is that a bra or girdle? It'll help if I do this. Oh, it's teeth. Yeah, dentures, dentures in a jar. In a jar yep. <laughs> and finally, every old lady needs a cat. Oh, it's a cat. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. Okay, maybe not my best work, but it works. Cheyenne needs a cat. So we need to get a cat is what you're saying. No, we do not need a everybody cat. Everybody heard that. Nope. Everybody heard that. Cheyenne's the old lady. A cat. And we could use maybe another bird, cat. but not no, a cat. We don't need another bird. We already have too, <laughs> too, too many of those. 
a summit and soul laid on 530. So also do 724. Hooray, June, July is gonna be a busy month. Oh, it sure is. All right, well, we tried to have Cheyenne deliver them on wingback, but uh, mm -hmm. she can't fly for no, anything. She can't so. anymore. Cheyenne, can you push these into the incubator for us? Push them in. Push them in. Ooh. <laughs> we'll say it counts. Good Yay, job. She almost did it. <laughs> well, I think that's going to conclude today's video. And Cheyenne, you did such a good job. Yeah, you set up a couple eggies. You first did. time. Good job. Oh, are you going to preen me? Thank you. Well, shameless shout out to our own merch. The Hatching Hognose Snake shirt is now available at snakediscoverystore.com. If you get one now, you'll probably get it in time to wear it while these eggs hatch. Yeah, while well, all these eggs hatch. Oh Look my at gosh. All Look There's at so many eggies. That's a ton of clutches. We're going to have, like you said, a very busy July. End of June, early or <gasps> mid-July is going to be a busy time here at Snake Discovery. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Patreon backers, as always. And thank you, Cheyenne, thank for setting you. up the eggies.